Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So I have another Boohoo haul for you guys and I have ordered so many <laughs> dresses i've got quite a lot of like summery dresses and a few other kind of like holiday pieces as well um so just to be clear everything in this video has very kindly been gifted by boohoo and they've actually given me a voucher code to share with you guys as well so i'll leave that on the screen here and down in the description box as well but it's louise h and it gets you 28 percent off of everything and then an extra 10 percent off of sale stuff but i'll put all the kind of terms and conditions down in the description anyway in case you guys did want to pick up a little bargain okay first item i have to show you is this really really cute little kind of summery dress so it's a really good length it's hitting me just above the knee i believe this is actually from the tall section and just to recap size wise i'm generally speaking about a size 16 on top and 18 on bottom and i'm five foot seven so as you can see this dress is hitting me like just above my knees really really nice length so great for you gals who are a little bit taller um it has an elasticated band around the back so it kind of like cinches you in at the waist here and it also has this kind of like frilly detail and it is black with a white kind of polka dot but the back is where this gets interesting okay so it's actually open back so this is the bit that's elasticated here so it's kind of cinching you in and then it just ties up at the back so i thought this would just be a really cute fun holiday dress would obviously look a lot better if i had a tanned back rather than that pasty thing um yeah really nice kind of comfortable the material is quite thin and floaty the material's not amazing quality i feel like from a distance it looks really nice up close it doesn't look as nice i don't know if you'll be able to see that well but overall it's quite i don't know i'm not entirely sure that this is very flattering on my figure but i do really like it and i think it's different and i think it's really really fun to wear on holiday or in summer whatever um and again this is quite versatile you could wear it out in the day and you could definitely dress it up in the evening as well bra wise i'm not wearing a bra um but i feel nice and covered and i don't feel like because it's quite high necked i feel like i'm kind of supported anyway but you guys will get sick of me saying this if you do feel like you do need a bra for a bit more support i would just suggest um getting like a bralette or crop top that has like a nice detail to the back so that when you do see the back it looks cute um so yeah really nice dress so i got this in a size 16 i'd say sizing is spot on um because i'm kind of like between sizes i don't know i feel like because this had a floaty bottom to it that's why i got it in the size to fit my top half if that makes sense um it also comes in like a lilac color this is the black there was like a rust a light blue and a yellow um so a few different colors to choose from there like i said it is from the tool section and this was originally 20 pounds and it's in a sale at the moment for 12 pounds um 20 pounds i don't know if this dress is worth it purely because the material isn't that nice but for 12 pounds i actually think that's bargain and obviously with my discount code you guys can get a little bit more off of that as well which will make it cheap as chips but yeah i'd say sizing spot on quality is just meh but it is a very cute dress if you're on a budget and you're looking to expand your holiday wardrobe definitely worth checking this out okay so next up i have this which is actually a play suit so it's a kind of off the shoulder style play suit you have kind of like seam detailing here for your boobies um this is like a tie thing that you can obviously have undone or you can tie it up as tight or as loose as you like it it's a kind of um ribbed stretchy material you have elastication all the way around here around your arms so obviously it's not going to move around too much this is actually from the tall section as well um and actually i think this is probably too tall for me like i said i'm five foot seven which i think is like just on the kind of tall like bracket 
Um, so I think this would fit me a lot better if it wasn't from the tall section because, right, so that's where the kind of band for the waist is and it's kind of got like a lot of excess here um, and also the crotch is very low on me, it's like down there. So it's, I got this in a size 18, I'd say size wise it's fitting me like pretty spot on, um, it's just the length feels a little too a little too long on me and like the crotch is just way too low it feels like I need to kind of hoist it up like this um looks a lot better but then I've got quite a lot of excess material so I'd have to like tuck it a little bit like that see I feel like that definitely looks better but I've taken it up by like a couple of inches there so I'd say for this sizing is spot on but if this just this one in particular um if you're around the five seven mark then it may be too long well obviously if you're a lot taller than that then you'll probably be ecstatic with it to be honest because i normally find play suits come up way too short but this is very generous um the material is it's quite nice actually it's just like a really thin kind of stretchy ribbed material i like a ribbed material because i think it's flattering it hides like a lot of lumps and bumps and stuff um and it's nice and stretchy and obviously it being thin is perfect for if you do go on holiday or on hotter days um yeah i've realized i have ordered a lot of black which is very true to my style i know i'm boring guys but i just think this is such a cute kind of like evening play suit um obviously you could have the option of oh i've got a belt here you do have the option as well of maybe like adding a belt to kind of dress it up i think for me i'd kind of have to do that because i'm struggling with it lengthwise i can kind of like tuck it out like that but yeah really nice comfortable like pretty decent quality um but definitely one for the taller girls so this also comes in white as well i i like the look of the white um but i i just don't know i don't think it would look as good when it turns up i just think it might look a bit cheap um but this was originally 18 pounds i think that's a little bit overpriced it's in the sale for 14 pounds 40 um which i think is much better pricing the only other thing i forgot to mention is i know it's difficult to tell because i obviously got it in black the booby cups there's like seam i'm calling them booby cups there is there's a seam detail right here and it's a little bit too small for my boobs so if I have the seam under my boobs, then I obviously have quite a lot of boob out, whereas I'd rather it was like that. It's not the end of the world, but I thought I would just mention it. Um, but yeah, pretty affordable, nice kind of comfortable holiday gear. This would also be great to wear on the plane as well. I know I'm talking about holidays loads. It's because I've just booked one and I'm obsessed. But yeah, you get what I mean. Okay, next up I have this dress. Um, do you know what? I'm not entirely sure this really suits me so just to give you a close-up this is a true wrap dress so you literally wrap it under there's a tie inside here and then you bring this path over tie it there and I need to kind of give you a close-up of this I think they call this dobby um it's just kind of like feels a bit like cotton wool but it has like a really nice kind of boho style dobby textured print on it again guys I think you're gonna get it now. I'm fully in like holiday mode and I'm looking at like cute little stuff I can wear out to dinner or on the beach. Um, and I saw this, absolutely loved it. Um, lengthwise, it is on the shorter side because it kind of like cuts off here, but then there is this kind of like longer see-through bit. So it does feel short, but you're actually covered, if that makes sense. I love myself a wrap. Um, I just don't know if this is maybe a little bit fussy. You've got like kind of fluting to the sleeve here. You've obviously got all the kind of texture detail. You've got more of like a ruffle trim at the bottom here as well. So there is a lot going on, but I do like this kind of like deep V style. I love myself a wrap dress. I just think that's so flattering. I do like it, but I'm just, I don't know. I need your opinion. Um, the only thing is this is see-through, but, I mean you can probably see my underwear 
Um, I am wearing dark underwear, so probably not ideal to wear with a white dress. But I think if you were to wear like a lighter colour underwear, you'd be fine. Yeah, I think I think light colour underwear would work, but just as a heads up, it is see-through if you're going to plan on wearing black underwear. I will say that the straps don't feel particularly strong, so these little tie bits, I wouldn't be yanking on them. Um, but it is a very cute dress, I'm just not sure, I don't know, I don't know, I'm just not sure. So I got this in a size 16, I'd say sizing is spot on. Um, if anything, maybe it's a little bit generous because I normally struggle getting stuff around my butt and the hip areas, but I don't seem to be struggling. They also do this in a black, which I'm not gonna lie, I do love the black. I am trying my best <laughs> to not buy loads of black, especially when it is like specific summery items. Um, and it also comes in a baby blue, which is also very, very cute. So this was originally 25 pounds. I ha the fact that it is like see-through, I do think that's a little bit much, but it's in the sale for 20 pounds, which is a far better price in my opinion. Um, but yeah, overall, sizing's good, pricing's not too bad, the quality is okay, um, nothing amazing. Could be better, but it's not bad. <sighs> okay, right, they're not all gonna be good. I've got on this dress. Um, Okay, right, so this is for the plus section. This is a smock dress. I don't normally wear smock dresses because I find that they're really not flattering on me. I'd say that this isn't the worst smock dress I've tried on, but doesn't mean I like it. So lengthwise, it's got good length. It does kind of like tuck in at my back a bit. Um, it's quite fussy, you've obviously got like frilling along the bottom, frilling along the sleeves, here, here. There's just a lot going on. It looks a bit frou-frou, a bit grannyish in my opinion. Um, one thing that I will say, in my defense, because obviously I did pick this dress, it did not look this color online. It definitely looked more of a kind of, um, a really light, natural kind of peachy pink if that makes sense not this is like baby pink um it does look cute on the model but i'm not feeling it to be honest um yeah i feel like this does nothing for my figure i'd like i feel like i've put on two stone just by putting this dress on the quality is not great it's very thin feels very synthetic-y it's also a little bit see-through as well obviously you can see my bra and probably, yeah, you can see my underwear as well. So, really not liking this in any kind of aspect, to be honest. This dress is 22 pounds. It's currently in the sale for 17 pounds 60. I still think that's way too overpriced. It is from the plus size um, range and their plus sizes run from 16 to 28. They also do it in black with a white polka dot or baby blue with a white polka dot. I think the black looks the best, but you guys know what I'm like. I think everything looks better in black because I'm boring. So yeah, would not recommend. Fair warning, you're about to see a lot. Um, bam, boobs. Um, okay, so this is a maxi wrap dress. I got this in a size 16, so Granted, normally I wear a size bigger on the bottom. I think I'd probably need to go up like two sizes in this, minimum maybe. So this is a wrap dress. Obviously I got it at 16. It's literally like just meeting in the middle for me. It's not wrapping whatsoever. So without completely flashing you, it only wraps like that much. Um, I don't get how it's because normally in a wrap dress the straps are really like long so you could wrap it all the way around even if this was the right size there's not enough kind of material to wrap over if that makes sense um so i mean i'm doing this up as tight as possible that's like as tight as i can get it and i've still got a lot of boob out okay this looks amazing online um right so 
print is this kind of like florally print. I actually really like the print and I actually think the quality of this dress is quite nice as well. It's very silky, very floaty. It looks so glamorous. I just wish it would wrap over so much more than it actually is. Um, you have this really nice kind of like frill detail. Um, it's kind of high at the back. So lengthwise, this is like perfect for me. It's literally just hovering above the floor. Um, but obviously I am 5'7", so anyone under 5'7 is really gonna struggle lengthwise. Um, also because it doesn't wrap, as soon as you start walking, you're gonna be showing a lot of body. Um, having said that, I actually think this would look really cute for maybe like more of a beach cover up, something you just wanna kind of fling on and tie up. It would actually work for that. It's really nice, floaty. I love it, but I just, I can't be walking around with that at the front. I, like I said, got it in a 16. Uh, it does also come in a yellow, which I do think is really like striking, really nice as well. I'm obviously just kind of drawn more to neutrals. I think the quality of the fabric's actually quite good and it's all sort of like double lined and everything. Really nice, feels quite good quality for Boohoo. Um, and this was originally £35. That is like way too much. Like that's really overpriced. It's in the sale for £28. And actually if this did cover me properly, I would think that's a completely fair price. I'm really disappointed because I, I think this is a stunning dress. The fit is just so bad. Okay, I've got another smock dress to show you guys. I'm preferring this one a lot more. Um, it's kind of like a t-shirty material with the polka dots printed onto it. I went for the black and white. Classic. Um, length, pretty good on it. It's exactly the kind of length that I would like. Um, it's nice, kind of loose, floaty, comfortable. It's a lot more simple than the last one I tried on. There's not loads of fussy stuff. Has these kind of like fluted sleeves, which I think is a nice detail, but that's it. Um, the quality of the fabric, the fabric itself is nice, but these polka dots are like printed on and they feel very plasticky. Um, they kind of feel very much like they're sitting on top of the fabric. Not the biggest deal, but I thought I'd just mention it. Um, let me grab that belt because I think would actually not wear this dress without a belt um just because i just don't think it's that flattering for my kind of figure i think that looks a lot better just cinching me in a little bit um but yeah i got this in a size 16 for me this is exactly how i would want it to fit i do normally kind of go towards the smaller size because i'm between sizes i always go for a smaller size when it comes to smock dresses anyway because I don't want them to be really big and baggy. I don't want to hide under a smock dress, but it is very comfortable. Obviously, it's not bad without the belt, but I just think it, it looks a little bit better. Very kind of stretchy, comfortable, um, a nice kind of chuck on dress. This is honestly the kind of dress like, you know, it's hot outside and you need to go and run errands or do a food shop or something like that. And you'd, I would just chuck on something like this and a pair of cute little plimsoll trainers or something and you're good to go, comfortable, you're gonna stay cool and still look cute doing it. So this is actually from the tall section as well. Um, in the photo, she's got it with boots. It looks really, really cool. I actually really like that. Um, so this also comes in white with black polka dots, which could look really cute as well. Um, goes up to a size 18, but I'd say sizing spot on. This was originally £15, reduced to 12 I think that's bargain. This is definitely something I'd recommend snatching up because it's just a really nice kind of like staple dress. Okay, last dress I've got to show you guys before I move on to some other bits. This is like the nicest but also the worst dress ever. Um, okay, so again, I got this specifically to wear on holiday. So it's this bro- bro oh my god, every time. Brodery Anglais style dress. Really nice lace trim, laces up at the front. I'm gonna take the camera down a little bit because I feel like this angle's weird. Yeah, that's a little bit better. Okay, so, um, this kind of like, broad, broad, oh my gosh, Brodery Anglais style material. You have this lace detail, really beautiful kind of off the shoulder, lace up at the front, cut in at the right place. You have these big balloon sleeves, 
not normally my style. I have been very vocal about the fact that I don't like a puff sleeve, but I don't know, I'm feeling it. Would I prefer it if it didn't have a puff? Probably. But I still think it works, it's cute. Um, and then the bottom is short. I don't mind it being that short. I'd say that it does fit quite well, as in it follows my curves quite well. I got this in a 18 and I can only just about put it on. It is extremely small. Um, I'm okay standing in it. I think I'd, I definitely wouldn't be able to sit in it. Um, it's also extremely see-through as well. As you can see, you can see everything. Um, I love this dress, but I am disappointed because it's tiny. <laughs> um it's quite short and it is see-through but I, I just i still love it do you know what i mean i just love hate it's a love hate thing um i just love all the detailing on it like all of the kind of trim around the bottom around the top here i just think it's so pretty let me show you the back as well so it does go like higher at the back i think they've done a good job with getting the actual fit on it right is in like you see all the kind of darts and it's fitted properly and it's kind of following my body as it should be. Um, obviously with the top half, because you have this, you can very much kind of loosen it um, to give you a little bit more room to move around. But obviously then you do run the risk of flashing a bit of boob. I don't mind going braless, but I wouldn't do it in this dress. I wouldn't be brave enough to do that. Uh, yeah. Okay, so this is actually from the plus range. It is fitting the model so differently to how it's fitting me. It's very much more of like a loose sundress, whereas this looks more painted on. Um, it was originally £30. If this wasn't see-through, 100%. Like, I'd 100% pay that. 24 quid in the sale at the moment. Um, I do think it's a great dress. It's very unique. If you don't mind it being a bit see-through, you're happy to wear nude underwear, or I don't even know if it'd be, it prob it would be, do you know what? I reckon it'd be all right if you were wearing nude underwear, but obviously still not great. Um, but I would say it does definitely come up quite small. So probably size up. Yeah, let me know what you guys think. I, don't, I never know if I'm just being absolutely brutal or if you think it's valid or not. Okay. Okay. Right. Next up, I have this top to show you guys. So this is like a peplum cami top. As you can see, I'm having a little bit of trouble over here. Let's pretend that's not gaping. Um, so do you know what? Right. The fabric of this, I actually love it. It's this kind of linen style fabric. This also comes in a couple of different colors. I think it's like a blush peak uh, blush peak blush pink and a kind of neutral color as well love the fabric i've been very vocal before about how much i love myself a peplum top i think it's just so cute flattering really kind of accentuates your waist um and this is like a really cute little summery top i got this in a size 16 it does not fit me quite clearly um i do love the buttons on this they're kind of tortoise shelly. They look like expensive buttons. However, there was another one here which has just fallen off when I tried to do it up. So, I mean, at the end of the day, this is very much um, a fast fashion brand. Don't expect the world of stuff, guys. Um, it's not built to last. But I do really like this top if it fit me. Um, I'd say it comes up quite small, so definitely size up. So yeah, like I said, I got it in a 16. Actually, I don't think they do it any bigger because it's not from the curve range. Um, so this was originally 16 pounds, reduced to 12 pounds 80. I do think the fabric of this top is really nice. Um, it looks, when it's not gaping at the seams, it looks more expensive than it actually is. It has like adjustable straps. A nice little kind of staple for summer. But yeah, just does not fit me. And then I'm gonna show you these shorts, but I'm gonna take the camera down first. Okay, so I always, oh God, what's happening? Um, I always size up in Boohoo shorts because I do find that they come up quite small. So I got these um, 
high-waisted black distressed denim shorts they're in a 20 so like I said I normally wear an 18 on bottom they're fitting me on my bum but they are absolutely massive up top um so they're definitely not shaped very well for curves these also look very different to online i don't know if you'll be able to see it on camera but this distressing is like a gray it's not black um they just weren't what i was expecting at all the quality of them's just okay the fabric's quite stiff which i personally don't like i like to have denim that kind of moves when i move so not a massive fan of these i'd say the fit is very off and the sizing probably a little bit off as well to be honest so these were originally 25 pounds very overpriced um and they're reduced by 52 percent to 12 pounds they look so cute in the photo i'm just disappointed this is what i've kind of got um yeah I feel like if I went a size smaller, like they're really pulling at my legs as well. I don't really know what's going on. I'm so confused. Um, yeah, so they're in the sale for £12. I personally just don't like them though. Okay, next up I've got this top on. Um, it's kind of like a milkmaid style top. Thought this would be really cute for summer. I don't really know. I don't really know what I think. The sleeves aren't sitting very well on me. Um, so you have, it's very simple, you have like ruching there and there. Just thought it'd be quite a cute little kind of chuck on top. I just don't know if it's the most flattering for me. Oh, I think I'm wearing it wrong. Oh, I thought it was meant to be off the shoulder. It's a sweet little top. I'm not sure I'm in love with it, um, like on me, but it is a very cute little top. I, I think I should have gotten a size bigger. It comes in a black or a baby blue as well which also look really nice this was originally 15 pounds reduced to 12 pounds which i don't think is too bad i think that's like spot on pricing the quality is like okay it's not bad at all i just don't think this kind of style top really suits me i think maybe it's because i've got a bigger bust that it's i don't know i just don't know i just don't think i'm in love with it but i think this pricing is pretty spot on I've also got this skirt on. I actually wouldn't wear these two items together, but I thought I'd just chuck them on and show you. Um, so this is like a, kind of like a midi maxi style skirt. It's in this kind of abstract leopard print design um, with a kind of fish taily bottom to it, which I think is really cute, quite fun and floaty. Um, length is really good on it. The quality of the fabric is okay it's quite thin and it doesn't have a lot of stretch to it um and then fit wise it's quite tight on my bum and hips but then i think it's not very flattering here because i've actually got a bit of excess material around my stomach area so it feels like it's kind of bagging there and maybe making me look a little bit bigger in this area um and it has an elastic waistband which isn't the nicest finish to a skirt but it's not horrendous um i do like it overall i think the print is really fun so i got this in a size 16 which probably explains why it's tight on my hips but i think i thought it was going to be a stretchy material and it's it's like really not very stretchy um so i'd say sizing is spot on if not maybe generous because normally a 16 just wouldn't fit me i do like that it kind of I don't know it kind of accentuates your hips because it comes back in like that i do actually really like that um so this was originally 22 pounds and it's in the sale for 17 pounds 60 which i actually think is pretty good pricing to be honest it's a really sweet little skirt and again this would look i personally just wear this with like a cropped vest top something really simple layer up some nice jewelry very kind of simple holiday maybe like a dinner out on holiday something like that very cute it's molded around my booty quite well actually and then last item guys so another pair of denim shorts these ones fit so differently to the other ones um so i think they're meant to be more of like a baggy style short um with this kind of turn up detail to them these are from the plus range i got these in a size 20 again so i have sized up in these 
Good thing I did because I wouldn't be able to put the 18s on. I'd say that the fit of these is a lot better because they come in at the top. I don't have a huge amount of excess material at the back like I did on the other ones. Um, these are quite a good option if you're looking for a longer kind of everyday style short. I don't know why, but for some reason I'm still getting a lot of pulling on my legs. Like, but they're not tight. I'm not sure. It's like when I move forward, it's like pulling weird um but yeah i like this distressing i like i think it looks cute with like a little white top they're quite comfortable and the length is really good on them so these were originally 22 pounds which is okay um and they're in the sale for 17 pounds 60. i just think they're okay they're not they're definitely not the best shorts i've tried on recently um but they're not bad um yeah definitely an option if you are looking for a longer style short so that's it from me today guys um bit of a mixed batch there because uh, they have a lot of nice stuff on there at the moment i definitely found some really really nice bits that i'm gonna wear a lot i will leave my discount code on the screen here again for you guys but yeah i hope you guys have enjoyed this video if you have please don't forget to give it a thumbs up because it really supports my channel and if you haven't already subscribed don't forget to hit the subscribe button and turn your notifications on so you never miss an upcoming video and until next time i will see you guys later